In today's video, we are going to be checking out all the leaked skins from the Critical Pass Season 28. So continue watching because these skins are getting really interesting by the seasons. With season 27 nearing its end, it is time for the knowledge of the season 28. So in this video we are going to be checking out all the critical pass season 28 leaks such as gun skins and emblems and basically anything else. So let's get on to the leaks. Make sure to join my discord server because almost 4000 people have joined so why don't you join as well because we have so many cool things there such as earlier leaks, we have a case bot especially for critical apps where you can open cases and get skins in, in the game bot you know and we have so much more customizations for every person who likes to use discord. So let's start off with the tier 2 grenade shall we? So first off, we have the smoke grenade danger zone, which looks like a B, you know, like the black and yellow, but not really, it's like those police tapes, like the black and yellow police tapes. The second grenade we have is called finish line for the frag grenade, and it's like a checkered frag grenade with like white and black. The final grenade we have is the flashbang called sporty, and it's, it's a mech skin, it's like a black and really dark blue, and it has this kind of reflection metal. So now heading out to the tier 3's we have grip for the MPX and a few other weapons and here we see like these kind of wheel discs and this red color. It's, it's an alright skin you know because I like red but you know not really my style unless I actually inspect them in the game as well. We have another grip skin for the deagle this time and this one looks really cool because the discs at the end of the weapon more looks like silver and the back is like red which it's cool skin actually for this weapon especially. This third weapon that has the grip skin is going to be for the AUG assault rifle. And honestly this skin doesn't really fit this weapon. The final weapon to get the grip skin is the SVD and honestly instead of the AUG this one is slightly better but still the first two weapons had the best ones. Now heading out to the tier 4's we have the FP6 error. Now with the error skin is actually it's an old skin. For example in season 1 there was the AK-47 error and that type of skin is now like 3 almost 3 years old so this is an OG skin in a way, you know, new skin, but the concept of it is old. Now the second weapon that has the error skin is going to be the M14 sniper rifle. And like I said previously, this weapon is still better than the SVD in a way, you know. But hey, it got a better skin in this season, so... The second tier 4 design is called Mechanisms and is available for the P90. It has these pipes on it and the back is like scratched a little bit and especially where the trigger is it looks really cool with its spiral. The second weapon that has this mechanism skin is for the XD45 pistol. And this mechanism one has these two spiral like ventilators on it and this one actually looks much better than the P90. Before we head off to the tier 5s make sure to like this video if you are enjoying this and also subscribe to stay tuned with new information regarding critical ops but for now let's continue with the tier 5s. The first tier 5 we have is the M4 Cyber War. The skin is mainly like a purple design with some guy with a creepy but also futuristic helmet on it and also the background has all these lines and circles. And the final skin we have is the AK-47 Spacewalk. Now this skin is interesting, I'd say. To me, it looks like a Galaxy PNG and everything else was just smushed onto it together. But hey, it's honestly not that bad for a skin, especially for the AK-47. And here are all the emblems from the next pass. The first emblem we have is called Armillary, where we have this golden sphere and all kinds of golden rings around it. Second emblem we have is called Charge Phone, where we have this phone with a 1000% battery percentage, which sounds illegal. The third emblem we have is called Hologram, where we have this holographic image of an AK-47. The fourth emblem we have is called Robot, and here we see this female looking robot with all kinds of wires in her neck. And the final emblem we have is called VR, where we see this pixelated background with this VR headset. 
So those were all the skins and also emblems from the season 28. Now in terms of the release day for this season, it could possibly be this week's Friday or next week for sure. And the next season may contain event cases again unlike last season. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, make sure to press that like button and subscribe to stay tuned with new information regarding Critical Ops and I'll see you in the next video. But for now, enjoy my crappy gameplay.